hello guys you're welcome back to afro black gossip we're still on the senzo meiwa's case and it looks like no stone will be left unturned this time around today's video is about kelly kumalo and one of senzo meiwa's friends his very close friend called tokozisi twala has decided to reveal everything he knows about kelly kumalo concerning the passing of his friend senzo meiwa kelly kumalo refused to hand over some of senzo meiwa's very important belongings to his family after his passing this is so shocking and it has brought a lot of problems and it has actually led to some suspicions concerning the person who was actually behind the killing of Senzo Meiwa. Well guys, we are going to explore all that in the video of today. Before we get into all the details, please subscribe to my channel, like this video, share and please drop a comment. Thank you so much. Tokozisi Twala, a close friend of the late Orlando Pirates and Bafana Bafana goalkeeper Senzo Meiwa, testified at the trial in the North Gauteng High Court that Kelly Kumalo, an award-winning artist and reality TV show star, refused to hand over Senzo's garments to his family following his passing. She allegedly stated that she was holding on to the garments until Senzo gave her instructions in a dream. Kelly and Senzo were dating at the time of his passing and their daughter Thingo is named after both of them. On October 26, 2014, the soccer star was at Kelly's house in, in Vuslorus Ekokoleni when he passed away. Tokozisi testified again on Wednesday, his second day in court. There were seven eyewitnesses to the robbery that allegedly ended Senzo's life and he was one of them. After Senzo was declared dead at the hospital, Tokozisi said he spoke with his family and his sister asked him to go get his ID. The following day, he went to Senzo and Kelly's place in Mulbartin and asked to see the identification. But Kelly said she would wait for Senzo's dad or brother to hand over the ID, so she declined. She gave up the ID, but she still didn't give up the clothes. She claimed that Senzo himself will reveal the fate of his wardrobe in a dream. Tokozisi, the fourth state witness in the murder prosecution of Senzo, stated that Senzo's girlfriend, Kelly, acted suspiciously when she refused to return some of the goalkeeper's personal items to the goalkeeper's family. Senzo was married to Mandisa Mkize and they had children together, but Kelly was having an affair with him at the time of his murder. If Kelly has decided what to do with Senzo's clothes, if he has given them to his family, or if the deceased footballer has told her in her dreams, none of these things are known as of yet. At this time, details are very scarce. Is Kelly Komalo just trying to be insane, or is she actually speaking the truth? How can she say she's waiting for Senzo Meiwa's revelation through her dreams? I mean, even if Senzo wants to talk to somebody concerning the fate of his clothes and his other belongings, we definitely don't think it is going to be Kelly Kumalo that he will give the revelation to. He had a wife, he had kids, and he definitely had parents and siblings. So he will be talking to them and not Kelly Kumalo, if at all that is real.